trees do the vital job of absorbing carbon dioxide, which contributes to global warming and producing oxygen. But at the moment, the only way to measure how much carbon dioxide is stored in a tree is to chop it down and weigh it. So a new technique is being developed which uses a terrestrial laser scanner to make 3D maps of forests, right down to the nearest millimetre, which can then be used to determine how much carbon is stocked in any given forest. Researchers at University College London, UCL, believe this could be an important development in the monitoring of carbon stocks for worldwide climate policy making. You can use our kind of laser measurements to estimate tree volume. If you've got tree volume, then the other thing that you need is the density of the wood that's in that tree. If you've got the tree volume and the wood density, you can estimate the mass of the trees. And so essentially what you can do is you can use the, the laser scanning to weigh trees. The terrestrial laser scanning technology is called LIDAR, Light Detection and Radar, and is said to be around 90% more accurate than current methods. This data can be used alongside precision photography to generate a three-dimensional portrait of a forest. The instrument sits there on a tripod and it, it spins round and it fires out a laser beam and every time the laser beam shoots out, and this is thousands of times a second, it records how far the laser has travelled uh, and essentially uh, the distance between the laser and the object that it's hit. And in that way, it builds up a three-dimensional picture of everything that's surrounding the, the laser instrument. Researchers from UCL have recently collected laser scan measurements from more than 1,000 trees in Brazil as part of a study into the the impact of drought in the Amazonian rainforest.